Today, we're really putting the U in Fansly U. Welcome to Statistics 101. While correlation isn't causation and all that, your Fansly stats aren't just indicators of performance. They can also help inform your content strategy so you can optimize for engagement and growth. To view them, click your icon and select Profile Statistics. In the upper right corner of this page, you can adjust the time frame of the data you want to review. And the first row here is effectively a summary. You can see the number of media views and profile visits, your average and total media engagement time, and how many unique viewers you had for your media and profile. So you can use this to get a high level idea of what days you were crushing it, how steady your performance is, or even areas for improvement. For example, say that you notice a big bump in profile visits and unique viewers, but not a corresponding bump in subscriptions or purchases. Maybe there's changes you can make to your profile that will spur users into unlocking your timeline and engaging with you further. Your media traffic stats are about the views or engagement on your media, and they're divided into two sources, profile slash timeline and for you page promotion, aka FYP promotion. If you're wondering what our for you page is, we have a video tutorial on it, so go check that out. But for your stats page, FYP promotion is what it says on the tin. The view or engagement is from a user while they were viewing it on the FYP. Profile slash timeline means it's a view from your profile or the user's timeline. So it's a visit from an existing fan or someone who clicked a direct link to your profile or someone who came to your profile from the For You page and is now interacting with your content on your actual page. The other kind of stats on this row, the profile visit stats, will also include profile slash timeline as a source and two new ones, suggestions and search. The suggestions tab is the box on the right of the timeline or at the bottom of the explore page where creator profiles are recommended to users that might enjoy them. You can increase your chances of showing up here for users by going onto your profile and categorizing yourself using profile tags. And search is from users searching on the explore page. So they found you by searching a keyword, a hashtag, or even your username. So to maximize traffic to your profile, not just singular pieces of your content, make sure you have relevant profile tags set and you're hashtagging your posts. Further down, you can see what percentage of your profile visits and media traffic are from each source. This can be really helpful for when you want to compare your performance in certain areas against how last month did. And if you want to get a real granular idea of how your content's performing, you can keep on scrolling down to the top media section. Here you can view your top performing media for your selected period, including a specific section for the media that you promoted on the For You page. You can then sort these by average engagement time or total views. If you're looking to fine tune your content, engagement time is probably the best stat to pay attention to here. While total views helps you get an idea of how widely visible a post was, a view can literally be someone swiping over your content before they've even seen it properly. If you click the three little bars by each media, either on this page or wherever your media appears across Fansly, you can access more detailed stats about that media and its preview image. This can give you an idea of how well your preview is doing for conversions, both on the For You page and with your existing fans. So if you're trying out different kinds of previewing, like blurring or censoring, you can adjust accordingly for whatever works best. And right below your top performing FYP media, you can see your top performing FYP hashtags. Now, we always recommend that you're making sure the hashtags are relevant to the content, as well as having a non-zero view count. But in this section, you can get an even better idea of exactly how each hashtag performs for you Maybe you can spot potential niches or patterns worth exploring further. As always, stay adaptive, experiment, analyze, refine, all those scientific sounding things, and you'll be on your way to even greater success. Thank you so much for watching and for being a part of the platform. Make sure you check out our other videos for even more tips and tricks on how to thrive on Fansly.